Hey guys, so I thought I'd show you the official int intro to the game, Dragon Age Inquisition, seeing as I didn't, I didn't show you guys the beginning of my character before just starting to upload the videos at like level 5, so. Let's take a minute to, um, listen to the, um, the theme music and talk about what's what you're seeing right here what's going on here basically the guys on the right of the Templars and the guys on the left of the mages so in case you don't know the whole thing in Dragon Age is the mages are thought to be too dangerous to to be allowed to be free so they're basically slaves well not slaves but yeah kind of in a way they're prisoners and they have to be kept in the circle tower under human law the chantry law what is it which is basically the human religion and um Naturally, a lot of the mages hate it. And right now, they're just going to... Since there was a mage rebellion, they're going to some peace talks with the head of the Chantry. The D Divine, she's called. So anyway, let's listen to the epic music for a minute. Alright, so let's get right to it. I'll try to make this quick. Yeah, I love the um, Dragon Age series. I wish it was real. I really do. It's, it's, I've played a lot of games in my time and this is one of the best. We're just going to do casual so we can hurry this up here. The, the, the Dragon Age world is just so intensely full of life that you almost wish that you could live in it. I mean, it would kind of suck to be a mage or, or like a poor... A poor person in it. <laughs> it would really suck. You'd be like dying of the blight or whatever.
I like the first one. I'm not going to be actually playing with this character, so... kind of half making this video for you guys in case you're interested in my let's play that I'm trying to put together for this game it all depends on whether or not it gets any views so if you guys could help me out drop a comment or something that'd be great tell me what you think But yeah, I'm partially making this video for my girlfriend because she hates video games and all that. And I'm just trying to get her to see the error of her ways a little bit. Because it really is amazing. <laughs> Tell me why we shouldn't kill you now. The Conclave is destroyed. Everyone who attended is dead, except for you. You think I'm responsible? Explain this. I can't. What do you mean you can't? I don't know what that is. Or how it got there. You're lying! We need him, Cassandra. So what happens now? Do you remember what happened? How this began? I remember running. Things were chasing me, and then... A woman. A woman? She reached out to me, but then... <sighs> Go to the Ford camp, Liliana. I will take him to the rift. What did happen? It will be easier to show you. massive rift into the world of demons that grows larger with each passing hour. It's not the only such rift, just the largest. All were caused by the explosion at the Conclave. An explosion can do that? This one did. Unless we act, the breach may grow until it swallows the world. Each time the breach expands, your mark spreads, and it is killing you. It may be the key to stopping this, but there isn't much time. So if I do what you want, will I live through it? We have no way of knowing.
They have decided your guilt. They need it. The people of Haven mourn our most holy, divine Justinia, head of the Chantry. The Conclave was hers. It was a chance for peace between mages and Templars. She brought their leaders together. Now they are dead. We lash out like the sky, but we must think beyond ourselves, as she did. Until the breach is sealed. There will be a trial. I can promise no more. Come. It is not far. Where are you taking me? Your mark must be tested on something smaller than the breach. Okay, so... Sorry I couldn't talk. Really, I kind of wanted to get Open the dialogue. Open the gate! We are heading into the valley. I kind of wanted to get the dialogue over with before the video ends. Um, so yeah. My actual playthrough of this um, that I'm going to be recording will not be with this character. It's going to be with my elf mage. So... Yeah, it's a really beautiful game. It looks really life lifelike. Like I actually grew up in a place that snows a lot and there's a lot of mountains and stuff. That's what it looks like. The pulses are coming faster now. The larger the breach grows, the more rifts appear, the more demons we face. How did I survive the blast? They said you stepped out of a rift, then fell unconscious. They say a woman was in the rift behind you. No one knows who she was. Everything farther in the You know, I don't like that that scene cuts off her conversation. At least the video is not going to cut off in the middle of the dialogue. Now! If you're going to lead me through a demon-infested valley, you'll have to trust me. Give me one reason to trust you. Because my life is on the line. <sighs> you're right. I cannot protect you. And I cannot expect you to be defenseless. Your life is threatened enough as it is. <clears throat> Take so, these potions. Maker knows what we will face. I was Where thinking are all your now? soldiers? At the forward camp or fighting. We are on our own for now. We'll check it out. We could put a helmet on already. Yeah, we're not going to. The video's about to end. But yeah, I was just thinking, you know how I'm picking the middle dialogue option there, instead of the, watch out. If we the top right or bottom right one? That's basically the neutral dialogue option.